guys welcome back so in part two here we're gonna take a look at how to register your song through song trust if you don't know song trust what they are is a music publishing administrator so it's a little different from signing an actual like pub deal where you give up part of your copyright ownership and you keep 100% of the copyright um, you do pay a little bit of a fee in your royalties, but that's pretty standard for anyone that's just going to go and collect your royalties for you. Now what they do that's different from BMI is once you're registered with BMI, that's registered in the US and it's registered with BMI only. When you do it through SongTrust, they go around to every other organization in the world and register it across all platforms. That way, no matter where your song gets played in the world, it will trace back to you in your earnings. Now you'll see my dashboard here in the beginning. Now I've only had Song Trust for probably a little less than a year now, and not much has accumulated yet, but it's starting as you can already see. So once you're signed up, loaded onto the dashboard, you wanna hit this little tab. And there's a lot of stuff that you can do, like set lists, you can see all the royalties, your account settings. Uh, there's a YouTube beta section that they're working on right now. Um, your songwriters and the songs. So we're gonna jump into songs And you'll see some of the songs that I've already registered and We're gonna do register a song and it's gonna be a new song so This is a song I released recently with an artist by the name of Jared Cruz The song was called Do You Like It? I produced the beat for it therefore I have 50 and Jared did the song and the lyrics and that stuff so he gets the other 50 so once you have the splits down if there was other writers you could add them here and you would just go add new outside writer or if they're already registered with song trust you can do that so you put in their name select their pro and their IP number kind of like registering with BMI that IP number is how it's like your stamp your identification card so next um, this is one that I like to have before I do this so you head back over to your BMI account once your songs been registered here and it shows the correct splits and has the ISWC code you're gonna want to copy that lyrics here your chorus if you have them this I don't have on hand with me so I'm not going to do that section but I could come back later and do that and then just review it and make sure everything looks good the splits the title the ISWC is there and hit register oh I had a feeling this might happen there's you gotta take hmm, I think you gotta take the period. There's some characters that it doesn't like. There we go. So you can add more recording info, or you can register another song. So I'm actually gonna do some recording info for it, because this is one part I really like about it. You can find it. Spotify. So this is the song right here. Jared Cruz, do you like it? The ISRC code. And you want to add this recording.
you can also add some keywords. So this is just all the little extra data that's gonna help identify your track, especially on Spotify. So I might even have this link in here. So now you have a recording with it and you have all your information. So the song has been received and is under review. And then this is when it will be sent to all the societies. Some societies will have it registered and when you get the check mark, it's been registered with all societies around the world. And you can start collecting your royalties and this is a big part. So we're just going to update song and it's been updated. So go back to your song list and we'll see that pop up and eventually when you go back into BMI here and you click on the track you will see uh, something under the publisher side here I'll give you an example of that so if I go to this track here um, in this case I have 50% of the writer share composition side and then my song trust takes 50% in the publishing side, that's their IP, and Mateo gets 100% of his writer's share because he's taking it by self-publishing, basically. So yeah, that's just how you get those two to work together and just make sure that everything is getting registered properly and around the world for you guys. Thank you for watching, I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe for more videos. Make sure to check Song Trust out if you want to learn more about music publishing. Peace.